computer. Miko Vans Log Supplemental. Okay, yeah, so check this out, check this out. So I've been, you know, working on other things around the base, and I'll show you that here in a second, but this guy just kept running and running, and I was like, what is it, you know, trying to fix? And, I, you know, I looked, and I saw that one gun, the only ghost projected piece was an underneath gun. You can't, I guess you can't really see it from here on the back. And I was like, what the hell? Why? I mean, they're going out green, they're coming back. I mean, they're going out magenta and coming back uh, green, so it looked like they were taking goods out. Well, it turns out none of the count was going down on my components at all. So I went out there and I'm looking at this piece while they're zipping out and zipping back. I'm standing right there and I'll show you that. It's just pretty creepy because I was like, what the frick is taking this thing so long? Are we down to really one piece? I mean, what the hell's going on here? Well, it turns out, and I'm sure you know if you've played the game at all, that these weapons have a big box. I mean, they have a huge box around them, like this guy. This is the one. So I dug out a little bit of dirt here because it was um, the box to it. See, look, it goes into the ground. I was like, what the frick, man? So all I did was hit, I just hit it once, and then they finished it. I was like, son of a bitch. So the whole time I was working around everywhere, um, it was just not doing anything, even though it looked like it was. I mean, it wasn't sparking or anything, but, the, you know, coming out magenta, going back uh, green... Anyway, I was say before I turned it off, I went ahead and killed it right now to be safe. I put these engines on because I wasn't really sure, you know, how I'm gonna do that. But I was like, well, you know, if I was gonna get off the ground, you know, maybe I maybe I only need one little one just to shove me straight up, you know. So at first I shoved this little guy on. I was like, you know what? I could just use one and overdrive it, man. Just to, just to, what the fuck is that? What is that? What the fuck was that? Oh, oh, it's my air vent inside. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what the frick? It got a leak. Um, so, yeah, I thought about that. Then I said, screw it. I'm going to put some big ones on because I'm going to need something to slow down and go fa you know, go faster. And then, But once I'm in space, I, so I decided to keep these thrusters because I know they work. I mean, I've used this ship. I mean, it was like, yeah, a year or two ago. I mean, look at this. is a, two years ago, man, this thing I made. I just dug it out of a folder. I said, oh, let's check it out. You know, I tried to paint it. Um, you can see I, the pink was just pissing me off. I was like, well, holy shit, what the... Maybe it just didn't look pink back in the old days or something. I don't know. Get rid of the damn pink, man. What am I, a fruitcake? This ain't Wilson's ship, man. This is mine. God damn it. So, oh, I probably just colored some of the black accent pieces up here. Uh, no. All right, so we're all right. So, anyway, I don't know if this thruster will burn off this guy, this uh, catwalk, and I, prob and I jammed this guy in, and for some reason, it let me go right to the dirt. I don't know how that's even possible, really, but it did, so I said, screw it. It's still above the landing gear. Um, so, yeah, I was about ready to kick on the nanite so I can, uh, you know, do, and I got my, you know, components on the outside. I didn't have a lot of room on the inside of this thing. And it was so old that you didn't... It was, none of this was even implemented. Air. <laughs> hydrogen. None of that was even in when I built this ship. So I shoved it on the top. I said, well, you know... And I got rid of some weapons that were up here. Because I'm, like, not expecting any, uh... You know, bad guys at this point. I, I could even get rid of these guys down here. I, I don't need them. That's not what I'm doing. And you know what? I could put a couple of down thrusters down here instead. I don't think there's any ammo in these. I just want to jump out of the way just in case. Okay, yeah, no ammo. So I might put a couple more thrusters down here. Because I really don't need these guys. So I'll put I'll put little thrusters. Um, I'm using the wrong... There we go. Got the greeny meanie right here. So this bastard here that was giving me so much slack anyway, I just got rid of. So there you go. So let's see, where's... I'll throw a couple more thrusters on there, because obviously I'm going to let the nanites do it. Where the hell my thrusters go? There they are. Let's see, number two. So, yeah, I figure, what the hell? It should work out all right. They're all, I mean, it should be piped in just for lift. This will get me off the ground. Once I tilt a little bit, I could jet forward, but this will get me off the ground. I'm a little nervous. 
Um, I just snaked in some landing gear. These are newer ones. It didn't actually have landing gear because uh, I don't even think landing gear was in the game back in the day. I could go ahead and finish painting this. Yeah, I don't give a crap. I just used regular white this time. Is that right? Is that right? Yeah. And what is this here? What is this? Oh, okay. This is the hole, so I must have had... Crouch down. I must have had... What the frick? God damn, that's loud. Um, and then there's another door there, so you go into one and come out the other. Or whatever. I mean, there's a gap between it. Um, I did not put a vent in there. That's that's kind of loud. Hey, crouch, man. What the, get me out of here, man. Oh, God, I'm stuck. That's it, I'm stuck. Terror. There's some terror going on. Get out. There we go. Woo. Get me out of here. Alright. Here we go. Don't like getting caught. Don't like it. Don't like it at all. So, yeah, I might do some accent painting or something. Here, stand up, dude. Um, but yeah, once I'm in space, these thrusters will be fine, so not a big deal. It's gonna be pretty freaking heavy, because it's like almost all freaking heavy armor. Anyway, I'm gonna turn on the nanites, let, let them go, you know, crazy on it. Here we go. Um, finish it off. Let's see, I do have ice in there. I threw some in that little connector right over there, in front of that thruster. So I don't know how those thrusters are gonna work, but, uh, let's turn this guy back on. And run! Over here. Run! There you go. Go crazy, bitches. That's what I'm talking about right there. Should we watch it? Let's take a look. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, little bastards. I love it, man. This is awesome. Get busy, bitches. There we go. Alright, so anyway, let me show you what I've been doing. Let's get out of the way of these dangerous sons of bitches. Alright, so what I did was... Remember how I was talking about putting that tunnel all the way down so I didn't have to take the elevator? Even though the elevator is cool, and, I, and I'll still do that every now and again. But what I did first... Oh, right... Well, let's see, was it... It was right after my last video... And before, oh, and by the way, this guy used to be hooked up there. <laughs> what the fuck is going on, man? How, why I got ended up over here? So I built this little structure here, just for grins. And I was like, you know, screw it. Let's just see where we can. If I, yeah, I don't know why that's so damn loud. But I built me a tunnel leading down into the depths. Now, this, uh, I did another one after I posted my video, because before I posted it, I did this. It brings me down to this room, which I thought was pretty cool. And a quick little access right there, Jackson. So that's pretty cool and all. But, what else I... Oh, look, check this out. Isn't that cool? That was a very awesome idea this guy had. So, we'll just take the long way back. Now let's see, if I stop here, I can jump. There we go. And we'll go back through, and I'll show you the other one I put in after I posted my last one. And then this one just goes down, so I was doing pipings. I think I showed that before. Do you notice a difference in the sound of this one and that one? Is it because that's the armored one out there? Yeah, it must be. And this is the glass one. As you can see, they're making some headway there. Hydrogen thruster. Wow, they already got most of it done. So, as you remember, I had a hole over here with an airlock. I could jump down into the bowel. So what I, I wanted was a ladder running down. And then Colin told me about this uh, catwalk one. It reminded me of it. Look at that. Look at that. Look, I even got an air vent right there. You see it? So the only problem is, is when you jump on the ladder, you got to hit the F key. Well, that also activates the door, so you got to kind of jump past and jump on the ladder. Because, oh wow, it did them both. Check it out. That's pretty cool, actually. I'm liking it. So I figured I would just bring, build a shaft here that leads down into separate parts. This one runs, I think, into that first room. Yeah, I should have made these the glass ones. I probably shouldn't have done the heavy armor. I might change those out. But I have oxygen in here. 
Yeah, it's a little bit more like somebody's kicking a cardboard box, isn't it? Yeah, or should I move that door in here? Why, why, why did I put that door so far back in there? Hmm. Yeah, let's put a glass one in. While I'm standing here, I don't really like the sound of that. I mean, uh, is this the armor one? Yeah, get rid of that fucking armor, man. What am I, in battle here? No. I'm not in battle, dude. Give me the glass one. It actually sounds cooler. So, let's say... I probably should have ground the other one away first. Do I have what it takes? Yes, I do. All right, cool. Yeah, see, that's a lot more friendly, isn't it? Let's get rid of that other one. Oh, wow. Um... There we go. Yeah, yeah, that's better. And I didn't even waste oxygen. So this one... Hmm, in order to get rid of this, I have to decompress so I don't lose all this air. Decompress, man. Do I have storage? I might not have any storage. And eh, whatever. I didn't do it. Damn it, I accidentally ground the wall. I wouldn't have happened if I wouldn't have ground the fucking wall. Um. Oh, Jesus! What the fuck just happened? Nanites! It's nanites! What are they doing? Are they grabbing those parts? They're yellow. What's going on? I'm trapped. There's some trap going on. Oh, Jesus! What happened? What are they fixing? Oh my god, they took the components! I had no idea they take components. That is amazing. Here, stand up. You'd be acting like a bitch. Um, yeah. Wow. Holy shit. That was amazing. So, if you drop shit, they come and get it. And I was trying to make sure that I have... The reason I had a space there is because I didn't have this airlock here. Um, at first. So I wanted a ledge, so if I jet up, I can stop on a ledge. So I'm still going to go ahead and leave. Finish it. Quick. Quick. Oh, I'm out of stuff. I'm out of stuff. Look out. Here they come. <laughs> Here they come. Oh. Crouch. Oh, Jesus. I love you guys. I love you. Come here. Moochie, moochie, moochie. It's like, you know, having a wild animal as a pet. You, you love them, but you just keep your distance, man. What are you, what are you crazy? Alright, so yeah. Let's do the other one. I gotta drop off some stuff, man, or something. I don't... Oh, let's do that again. I wanna do that again. Sorry. That was just amazing that they came and grabbed all the shit. Now, I don't mind that one being, uh, you know, heavy armor because it leads down into the bowels, but. Uh... Oh, jeez. Really, I hate that. I hate this door. So let's drop some more components. Run. Run for it. Oh my god, I, I got the wall. I didn't mean to get the wall. Oh, they'll do that too. Whoa, look at that. So the yellow ones are the gatherers, man. Look at that. You know how many times people just lay there, they just drop shit everywhere? Hey, don't forget about the computer. Silicon, grab it. Now, I don't know if they're breaking it down or what. I think they're just taking it back. Wow, it takes so many of them just to grab. Okay. I'm going to slap another one in. Now, do I need another one? I do because if I open this bottom one, it goes to... um. There's no, um, what you call, atmosphere down there. So, all right. So, we'll slap one of these in. And run. It's amazing. So they must be done with the ship. That they just dash out here and do all this crap. Yeah, and I'm going to change this one too. Internal doors do not need to be this way. Um, here, let's drop off some goods. Let's drop off... 
couple of hundred of these. Couple hundred of those, a hundred of those, couple hundred of these. I don't need to be that greedy. Wait, no, 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 no. We'll get a couple more of those back, buddy. Um. Okay, so now we should be able to grind this. These are a little bit more... Oh, Jesus! Turn it off! These are a little bit more expensive, too, if I'm not mistaken. Look at that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Um, can I carry all that? Let's try it. Oh, shit. Quick! Fix it! Fix it! And why do I keep turning on the goddamn... Okay, we're good. So yeah, this is the kind of shit I've been doing. I thought, you know, having this back door would be kind of neat, actually. And, um... And remember, these big hallways, do they have a membrane here, so my... Just wanted to see if I see them zip by. Nope. Um... So yeah, the oxygen doesn't, um... Oh, that's my main entrance to the elevators, by the way. The, yeah, there's a membrane right here, so none of the air from this room can get out. But I... Oh, yeah, so we got oxygen. So yeah, it's coming along pretty good. I like it. Um... Yeah, now we're back on the regular track. Got all these assemblers up and running. Um, down there. Yeah, I haven't gone any further as far as the um, hallway goes, but I'm, I, I kind of want to mess with that the ship. Let's go see if they got it done. So at least I have like a shortcut here, you know. Yeah, this door sounds a lot better than that somebody kicking a cardboard box door. I mean, you go through more doors this way, but... So I should be able to open up the hatch. Yep. Here we go. Look at that. So yeah, good idea, man. That was a good idea. And it, it, you know, I don't have to have it as an airlock. Um, and you got a back door. Got access up here. So we got we got a lot going on. So let's go check on the ship. And I haven't cut it loose yet, so it's really basically start. It's still part of the base. Um, I didn't have a merge block or anything. I didn't really think of it. What's green mean? Does green mean idle? Yes. Okay. So let's take a look. So we got the hydrogen tank, which probably doesn't have anything in it. Oh, I got to set this thing to stockpile, right? Isn't that, isn't that what we discovered that one time? So I think you have to have auto refill and stockpile. Yeah, that, that way it'll suck it. From everywhere, I guess. Um, so I'm gonna need to get a bunch of ice out here. I think I have a lot of ice. Do I need to get a ton more ice? I don't know how much ice. But once this is full, and I get out of orbit or into orbit, I still will be nowhere near. I don't even know why. I mean, you gotta remember, I don't. I didn't really need this ship. At what, what the original design was, it would project. Um, yeah, let me just jump right down here. Project a Stargate base, which I do not have access to that blueprint, I don't think. Um, I kind of looked through it. Uh oh. Now nah, we're good. I looked through it to see... You know, I ought to cut it loose first before I do that, because right now I'll be seeing everything on the base. Oh. Well, I turned that on a little late, didn't I? Um, I could cut it. Oh, no, I can't. I gotta wait for the hydrogen. So let's see what we got in here. Maybe I should grab some more ice. No, 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 no. I do... Do I have a lot of ice? Oh, I guess I... I don't know how much ice you need. Like a couple K, right? Or 5K, maybe? Let's grab 5K. At least. Then we'll go... Slam it in the ship, uh, and I'll show you the ship. I haven't upgraded the, the um, cockpit yet, but I'm going to. And you know what that means. I'm going to leave. Yeah, let's go inside. There we go. And I have this one. 
it's an external door, so I lifted heavy armor, but maybe I should switch this one out to um, glass. Yeah, let's do that. I, mean, I don't know what the hell sound effect that is, but that's just like the stupidest goddamn thing ever. Ooh, are they going to come try to fix this while I grind it down? Probably. No, okay, we're good. Alright, so now we're going to slap a regular internal airlock in. Oh, look, it's white. Oh, that's alright. Oh, oh. Can I get it done? Nope. Run over here. Get out of the way. Here they come. There they are. <laughs> yeah, you really gotta stay out of the goddamn way, that's for sure. Now, I'm not sure, but these guys were like, um, controllers for the weapons. I mean, these were weapons control back in here. I don't really need those, but I'll leave these guys for charge-up seats. And as we can see... I mean, it's kind of pretty cool looking, I guess. I mean, but dude, this is old school, man. I built this so long ago. Look at it. It's not even really... I built this before they had any of the new blocks. Or anything, so... Uh-oh, what's going on? What's up with that? What's going on with that? Oh my god, what, what the fuck's going on? Why is it going up and down like that? Do I... I don't have a hole. I knew I was hearing something. Is it just on, or what's going on here? I don't think there's a leak. There's, I don't have a leak detector anywhere. So... I don't know what's going on with that. Uh, do I need a door here? Maybe I need a door here. Let's slap one in. Because, you know, you never know. You might get a leak somewhere else. Just don't have bulletproof glass. What the hell was that? Oh, Jesus. All right, there they go. All right, so now this one, is this going to stay up? Oh, okay, so it just probably does that when there's an open corridor? Probably. Never really noticed that before. Okay, so now we're in here with no oxygen. So it must be this fucking hallway. And you know what? It could be... I mean, I got storage containers. I got this guy. I don't know if there's an angle piece. So, yeah, there's an issue, man. Because even this guy can't fill the hallway. Oh, it's this guy. What the frack, dude? What are you doing? Where are you at? There you are. What? Oh, okay. So this one was sucking out everything. Alright, but I still... Do you think I should have an airlock right here from the bridge? Probably, because what if the window gets broke? I mean, you don't want everybody dying. So let's slap one in here from the other side so I can run. So we'll slap, or should we put a different kind of bridge door? Maybe it doesn't have to be, because, does it have to be an airlock? Yeah, well, whatever. Let's put an airlock in, right? I mean, they're kind of cool. I kind of like these doors. These are pretty nifty doors. Um, do I have other doors? I don't want to use, I mean, I, I'm thinking airlock. I mean, we're kind of limited on what airlock doors you can have. I got those two. This one's kind of cool. Airlock door glass. And then you got a corner. We could try one of these. I mean, you know. At least you can see through it. You know what I mean? I don't have any... Bulletproof glass is my only drawback here. And I'm not hooked into anything. Actually, these doors are pretty cool, too. Yeah! Look at them, man. Look at them. Cute little fuckers. Oh, I hear them still. These are pretty cool doors, too, for internal doors, don't you think? You can cut. They're doing something. Hear it? Oh, maybe that's just their base. So maybe we can put another one in. What? No, we got this one. All right, so we're, we're kind of safe. Well, maybe I should replace this with one of those. I don't know. These are all right. Doesn't really matter. I don't know where I'm going with this thing. It's just a projector ship that's supposed to project. You know what? I do have large fucking cargo containers in there. Like, what was it, three? 
What if I put a nanite station on it? I got three large cargo. Right? So I could slap another nanite station on the roof. Or anywhere, really. Well, no, it has to be outside. And then, uh... Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I'm thinking that that's gonna blaze this off. And probably the ladder too, but... Eh, whatever. If it does, it does. Then I'll just put a, um, a lip under there, heavy armor. So, if I put a project... Do I have any more connector? You know what? I could do it right here. I could slap a whole new one on. Right there. It's centered. Or will it stick over those... Hmm... What's well, a projector ship? Yeah, hell, I could put it right there on top of the goddamn. If I, I don't know if I'm gonna close all this in or not, but let's take a look here real quick and see how that would fit. Because if I'm gonna project um, stargates in the asteroid belt, let's say. And if I was to slap that down right there. They would come build it. It would automatically come on. <laughs> but it doesn't have anything in it. Now if I do that. Can I just slap it here? I could pipe it a different way. It might be better if I piped it. If I do it here. Yeah maybe I should do it here. If so if I do that. God these are expensive. I wonder if I have what it takes. Then when I project. The Stargate little platform and all that it would automatically yeah what the fuck let's do it look out run away run away it's gonna eat up all my resources you do know that right here they go there they go yeah it's gonna eat all my resources but yeah it makes sense that I would fly near an asteroid I would project it so it's jammed in the rock a little bit and then uh it might make it easier for mining. Like I could just jump through a stargate. I call it stargate a wormhole. Then I could real quickly run up there and grab some silver or gold manually even. You know what I mean? Instead of having to take a ship. Or I could gate through with that small little miner to just go up there and get some. I don't have to use my big giant ass miner uh, all the time. Um, I bet you I run out of shit. There's no fucking way that I have enough shit here. But we'll see how that works out, and obviously it's going to come on automatically, but I don't have any supplies piped in there, so it'll just be dormant, most likely. So yeah, that's where I'm at on this. I hope you think it's cool. I think it's really cool. Um, and then maybe I'll do that. Maybe I will, um, <clears throat> because obviously, actually... I wouldn't need that big guy to go to the Earth-like planet. I could just use this. And then go down there and project a gate. So that means I have to set up... Oh, wow. Look at that. Look at that. I'm going to have to set up a little temporary gate area. Because I can't find my original. Um, I, I, it's what it, what it looked like was... Remember originally on my first Let's Play on... Uh, on um, was it on the moon? Yeah, on the moon. <clears throat> that original little uh, um, base with the gate that we discovered, it's that. The original one. You know, it had like uh, reactors and that room and all that. That's what it was. But I could even simplify it. I could make it more... I just need a real simple starter gate and then we can fly to the Earth and that. I don't know. Is, that, is, it, is this worthy? I mean... Oh, is there a function that I can tell this to disassemble a projected? Look, if I turn the projector on, will it go and... Oh, see? Eh, I, gotta, I gotta talk to that guy. I want disassemblers, man. Not just assemblers. I want to say... Like, say you color it a certain color, like red. Anything red will be... Dis you know what I mean? Then you could just, like, paint this thing fucking blood red and it'll just eat everything. That might be kind of cool. But it is still parked in the in the projection spot. That might work, except for all the extras. They would just fall to the ground. Nah, I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna use it. 
to go to the Earth-like planet and project a um, a Stargate. And then we can uh, then that's how we can get there instead of using this guy, this lander. So if I do that, do I just um, what the fuck do I do with the lander then? Because once this is out of the way, I'm putting those solar panels back on it that I took off. And I think I might have uh, blueprinted this out. What is that? Uh, control B or something? Yeah, so anyway, that's how I get my backups. But you guys have a good one. I'll catch you next time, and we'll see how this works out. And then I'll probably be heading off to the Earth planet. I might as well. I mean, hell. Aren't we getting kind of tired of the moon situation here? I mean, look how desolate. So I'm going to have to stockpile on ice. We'll have to go mining again for ice. I hope you don't mind. Whoa, what was that? Did you see that? I saw something. I thought it was like a fl shooting star or a nanite or something. Anyway, you have a good one. I'll catch you next time. Computer. In log.